Hey team, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a butt and thighs workout. All right team, you don't need any equipment to touch your mat and your water bottle. Let's get ready to rock. All right, team, we're gonna start with just a simple warm up. We're gonna start with some knee hugs. So go ahead and pull one knee up, give it a little bit of a tug, then bring the other knee up, give it a little bit of a tug. All right, team, it's alternating sides right here. Good. So I came to film in the park today and I found this little spot with these shed yellow flowers off of it. And I was like, I wanna go film in the flowers. So <laughs> please take in all the yellowness around me. Good, team. Beautiful. Good. Nice lower body workout today. So we need those hips, hamstrings, quads, calves, all that fun stuff, nice and loose. Beautiful team. Go ahead and come towards one side of your mat or tiger and come to hip openers to a lateral shuffle. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this inside hip right here, swing it open and then lateral shuffle across. Take the inside hip, swing it open, lateral shuffle back. All right, team, alternating sides right here. Good. Beautiful team. It's a lovely day. Good. It's less windy than it's been lately. Um, also, I am filming this workout a little bit in advance. Um, by the time this airs, I will actually be in Kauai. So if you're like, is she gonna tell us how her half marathon went? Not yet. <laughs> Good team, next workout. Beautiful. Got a couple more here. Perfect. Good, go ahead and come into your natural squat stance. We're gonna come to an alternating squat to hamstring stretch. Go ahead and come down, bring it up, and then hinge of the hips, reach for those toes. Beautiful team. Good. Loosening up those hips. Good, and don't worry about getting super low in the squat. It's just a warm up. Good team, good. I actually fly out um, to Kauai tomorrow. Kauai is my favorite Hawaii. You can't go wrong with any of the Hawaiian islands, but Kauai is my favorite. It's just gorgeous, beautiful team. So I'm so excited. We are gonna spend a whole week there and I didn't wanna film on vacation. Good team. I just wanna actually take vacation, you know? Good, let's go with one more each. Perfect, go ahead and take it from the top. We'll come right back into those knee hugs. Good. But hopefully I'll get lots of awesome footage for you guys to share on the next workout. Beautiful. Kauai, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Good. Oh, well, I mean, I live on Oahu, and Oahu's pretty too. Um, but Kauai is called the Garden Island for a reason. It's just lush greenery and waterfalls and just this gorgeous little rock that came out the ocean. It's gorgeous, beautiful team. Good. Beautiful. A few more here. Good, go ahead and come back towards one side of your mat or towel, back into those hip opener to lateral shuffles. So I had a dream um, last night that I was like Snoop Dogg's best friend and I got to go around and hang out with Snoop Dogg, which is like, I love Snoop Dogg, good team. Um, especially Snoop Dogg of today, where I feel like he does so much to try and give back to his community. Beautiful team. Go ahead and come into your natural squat stance. We'll come right back into that alternating squat to hamstring stretch. Good, which is awesome. He does a lot for the youth. Um, and I saw that him and Steph Curry built a basketball area for the youth in this underprivileged neighborhood. Good. And I just thought that was so great. And then it was like, imagine like being a kid and going to basketball practice and it's like Steph Curry and Snoop Dogg are there in your practice. That's so awesome. Beautiful team. Good. Just go with one more each, wherever you are, even it out. Perfect team. Good, go ahead and come down on all fours right here. Take your time getting here as we come onto palms and knees and into a cat cow stretch. So go ahead and drop the belly, look forward, arch in the back. Good, and curve, belly button to spine. I just heard that giant bug, but it didn't come towards me, it went away from me. Good, big arch, it made me twitch a little bit. Good, and curve. Beautiful arch, and curve. We'll go one more each, big arch, and curve. Perfect team, go ahead and come into a neutral spine right here. Curl those toes under and peel the hips up nice and high into a down dog. Take a moment here to pedal out the feet, shake off your fluff. And then when you're ready, go ahead and take the left foot, step it forward into your runner's lunge. Find your footing first, then you're gonna go ahead and rise up into a high lunge, shake a big beach ball up and overhead. Get this right hip tucked up underneath you, pull the left hip crease back. Good team. Now from here, you're gonna alternate between here and then raining the hands down and straightening out through that front leg pyramid posture. 
beautiful high lunge and pyramid. Good, high lunge and pyramid. We'll go one more each. High lunge and pyramid. Good, this time go ahead and stay down. Bring the left hand to the right side of the left foot. Open up that left foot a little bit. Plant the right palm and open it up. Big twist right here. Left arm comes up. Beautiful, spike that back heel back. Get a nice stretch in that calf. Good, and go ahead and rain it down. Plant the palm, step that left foot back to meet the right. Shake it off right here. We'll do the same little dance on the other side. So go ahead and step just the right foot up. Find your footing first, and then rise up into a high lunge. Take a big beach ball up and overhead. This time, get that left hip tucked up underneath you. Pull the right hip crease back. Beautiful team. Good, and then when we're ready, we'll go ahead and bring the palms down. Straighten out through that front leg. Pyramid posture. Good, high lunge, pyramid. High lunge, good, pyramid. Bending and straightening those legs. High lunge, pyramid. And we'll go one more each. High lunge, and pyramid, good. This time go ahead and bend that front knee. Bring the right hand around to the left side of the right foot right here. Plant that left palm and open up the right big twist. Beautiful. Give yourself plenty of space here. Good, spike that left heel back, drop the hips. Good, then go ahead and bring that right palm down. Step that right foot back to meet the left. Last little shake off right here, pedal of the feet, shake off your fluff. And then when you're ready, take a nice walk up towards your hands right here. Meet your breaking point, roll it up, get some water if you need it, and we'll come into the first circuit. All right, team, so coming into our first circuit, we're gonna start with a pull squat to an instep tap. So go ahead and come into your natural squat stance. You're gonna pull squat from here. So come all the way down, come part of the way up, come back down, and then up. And then I'm gonna take my right foot, step it towards my left. Then do a little pull squat. Left foot goes towards my right. All right, team, alternating sides right here. All right, when you're ready, we got 30 seconds on the clock. Let's work. Beautiful. Good. Good, team. Use your glutes to stand this back up. Glutes and quads should be fired up. Beautiful team. I hope you guys can hear it. I hope my microphone picks it up, but these birds are making quite beautiful melodies. Lovely songs going on. Um, and you might see them the other day I was here and it was like a whole bunch of them flew up in the trees at the same time. Perfect team. Beautiful, shake it off. Go ahead and take the feet nice and wide, wider than they would be in a typical squat stance and toes point slightly outwards. You're gonna alternate between a sumo squat to a good morning. So hands up behind the head right here. I'm gonna sumo squat, squat down, come up and then I'm gonna good morning. So I'm just gonna hinge at the hips, push the booty back and stand it back up. Alternating between those two, all right team? Got 30 seconds on the clock, let's work. Beautiful. Um, but yeah, they're really, really teeny birds. And they're like my favorite cause like they travel in packs and yeah, they all went up in the trees at the same time. And I was like, oh, what are they doing? Super cute. But that sounds like the little, the little tweets that they make. And I can't even imitate it, but it's interesting. Like birds are kind of like the main thing that you'll see around here, many different varieties. Um, and my fiance and I, perfect team, shake it off, we're gonna cut to some around the world lunges. So go ahead and bring both feet together towards the center of your mat right here. I'm gonna go ahead and plant the left foot. I'm gonna start with the right foot right here. And I'm gonna go around the world. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a front lunge, lunge forward, a lateral lunge to the side, and then a reverse lunge. All right, team? So front, lateral, and back, and repeat that over again, doing around the world. Go 30 seconds, staying on the same side, then we'll switch sides. When you're ready, team, let's work. Um, but we heard, we heard lots of bird noises and we're to the point now that he was like, oh, are the chicks here? And I was like, that's not a chicken call. Um, and he listened and he was like, you're right, it's not. I think it's a, like a finch or whatever he said. And I was like, it's interesting. We're starting to be able to tell the birds apart. We've never studied them or anything. Um, but we know our chickens when we hear them. Perfect team. Beautiful, nice strong legs. Perfect, shake it off, same thing, opposite side. Go ahead and plant the right foot, left foot's gonna go around the world. There's a second on the clock team, let's work. Beautiful. Yeah, I think um, the chicks are the ones we hear the most often. There's a mama chicken that likes to come into our backyard relatively frequently, at least daily, um, typically multiple times a day. <laughs> and so, and she's got like a little flock of chicks we've been watching grow um, so we know them <laughs> I know those little chickadees beautiful team 
good. I'm talking too much, getting sidetracked, almost fell over. <laughs> Perfect team, shake it off. We're gonna come to pike glute raises. So I'll go ahead and come onto palms and toes right here with the hips up nice and high. Now from here, I'm gonna come down to bear hold. I'm gonna go ahead and bend both knees into bear hold and pike it up, lifting the left leg up into the air, squeezing that left glute, bear hold back down, and then pike it back up, lifting the right leg. All right, team? 30 seconds, I'll hang sides right here. When you're ready, let's work. Beautiful. Good, team. Good. And when you come down into bear hold and then pop back up, those quads are gonna be working in that movement. Beautiful, team. So if you're feeling it there, that's why. Good, but make sure you're lifting from your core and not just dumping your weight into your knees. If you feel a little pain in the knees, a little twinge there, because you need to use your core to help it lift you up. Beautiful, team. Perfect, shake it off. Go ahead and come on up. We're gonna go ahead and take that circuit from the top, so we'll come right back into that whole squat to an instant tap. 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Beautiful. Good, team. Yep, I knew it. I was like, that sounds like the little chirpers. There's a little pack of them behind me. <laughs> Good, team. I don't think they're, it might not be visible on the camera, but they might come this direction. But yeah, they're real teeny. I think they're so cute. Beautiful, team. Little, they're like brown and gray. So it's like little Tweety birds, but they, I think I just think of Tweety because they're little, but they're not yellow. <laughs> Good, team. Perfect, shake it off. Go ahead and take the feet nice and wide. Alternating sumo squat to a good morning. Hands up behind the head right here. Let's take us on the clock team. Let's work. Beautiful, hinge at the hips, use those glutes. Good team, good. This hinging movement is gonna, I know like, I think it's social media culture has made it, everybody think that squats are what's really gonna build your glutes. Um, um, it's deadlifts team. <laughs> the hinging movement at the hips right here, that's what's gonna do it for you. Good, beautiful. Perfect, shake it off. We'll come right back into those around the world lunges. Go ahead and plant the left foot. Right foot's gonna work. 30 seconds on the clock team. Let's work. Good team. Um, yeah, your deadlifts, your hip thrusters, glute bridges, good. Those hingy and straightening movements right here in the hips. Um, that's what's gonna make your glutes build a little more than squats will. Good team, beautiful. Not saying squats don't hit it, but I would definitely say deadlifts are more effective <laughs> if that's a goal of yours. Perfect team, beautiful. Good, shake it off, same thing, opposite side. There's a second on the clock team, let's work. Good, I feel like this workout's going by fast. I'm all, wow, that was 30 seconds already? Good, good team. Good, nice strong legs. I'm so excited for waterfalls. Waterfalls in Kauai, they're everywhere. Good team. And I looked up um, like vegan restaurants and stuff to go to. Our friends are coming and they're actually vegan as well. Good. But they are coffee drinkers and we are not. Perfect team. Shake it off, go ahead and come right back into that pear, pear. Pike to bear glute raises. So <laughs> go ahead and come on to palms and toes right here. Hips up nice and high. 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Drop it down, raise it up. Um, so it didn't even cross my mind to look into coffee places when I thought about it and I was like, oh, like Hawaiian coffee, Kona coffee is like a thing around here. So I, <laughs> I bet there's plenty of places on all the islands. Good, team. Beautiful. Yeah, I don't consume any caffeine. I just don't want to be like, depended on it to go about my day. Good team. So yeah, I don't drink coffee or any other caffeine. Perfect team. Go ahead and come on up, shake it off, get some water if you need it. Then we'll come into our second circuit. All right, team, so coming into our second circuit, go ahead and come into your natural squat stance. We're gonna to come to a squat to squat calf raise. So go ahead and come all the way down into your squat, come about halfway up, come back down. This time, come up onto the tippy toes calf raise. Big squeeze in the calves right here, all right, team? 30 seconds on the clock, let's work. Little pulse, and then explode up. Good, if you're feeling extra energetic and you wanna turn this into a squat to squat jump, you are welcome to. Good, or you can rock it nice and low impact like me. Beautiful, team and just focus on contracting the right muscles. Ooh, quads are burning. Coming into the second circuit, I felt that immediately. Beautiful, team. 
Good. This is where results are made. Beautiful. Perfect team. Beautiful, shake it off. I come to a single leg deadlift to a lateral leg raise. So go ahead and walk the feet in right here, plant the left foot. I'm gonna go ahead and send the right foot back right here. Single leg deadlift, hinging at the hips, then come up to standing, and then take that right leg, swing it out to the side, engage that outer hip. Single leg deadlift, you can send the arms out to counterbalance. Lateral leg raise, all right team? 30 seconds, staying on the same side, and we'll switch sides when you're ready team. Let's work. Good. Good, send it back, working that left glute on this single leg deadlift. Beautiful. Good. And if balance is not your strong suit and you want to hold onto a wall while you do this, good. You can, team. Beautiful. Good. Or maybe we just don't come down as far. We go as far down as we can and go nice and slow. Take your time here. It's not a cardio workout. Good. More about form and contracting the right muscles. Perfect, team. Shake it off. Same thing. Opposite side. Go ahead and switch your weight over to the right foot. Send the left foot back. 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Beautiful. Strong legs here. Good. If you want to challenge your balance, you can keep this foot off the ground the entire time. Beautiful team. I did a couple of reps like that and I was like, oh, I don't know why I'm not touching the ground. <laughs> but you can, it's an added challenge. Beautiful. Good team. Good. Good team. There's some. Puppies going by, perfect team. Shake it off. We're gonna go ahead and come down onto the ground and come into some frog pulses. So go ahead and come down flat onto the belly right here. You can make a little fist right here to give yourself a pillow and then go ahead and come down right here. Bring the knees out nice and wide and then the feet together. Now from here, I'm gonna squeeze in the glutes, lift up the thighs off the ground and then back down. All right team, if this is much too much, it's also okay to bring it in a little bit and then go one leg at a time. All right, team, so meet your appropriate edge for today. Get into your froggy pose. we got 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. This is a small movement that's really effective. Good, you're gonna feel the burn. Beautiful, team. Good, and if it looks like my thighs are not coming up, they are, but <laughs> I was like thinking about it and I was like, you know what, I bet the grass is, because it's such a small movement, I bet the grass is making it look like she is not lifting off at all. Yes, I am, I was <laughs> squeeze the glutes. Beautiful, team. Good. Beautiful. Good. Channel your inner froggy. Perfect team. Go ahead and drop and go ahead and come onto your side right here as we stick with our animal themed glute exercises. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and come into some clams. So go ahead and bend the knees right here and lift the feet up off the ground right here. Now from here, I'm gonna go ahead and take this top leg and just open it up just like a clam. We got 30 seconds staying on the same plan, then we'll switch sides. Are you ready team? Let's work. Open it up. Beautiful. Engage this outer hip. Beautiful. Good. Also, if this is much too much, you can put the feet down on the ground and lift from here. Beautiful team, but ideally get that slight internal rotation of the hip with the feet coming up off the ground and then open it up. Good. Strong bodies here. Good. If you're like me, an internal rotation is a little bit uncomfortable. Just do a slight lift. Perfect team, beautiful. Same thing, opposite side. I'm gonna go ahead and press on up and switch over. You can just roll over. <laughs> also an option. I need to stay facing the camera, but go ahead and come on down right here. Lift up those feet. 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Beautiful. Good, I'm realizing that my microphone is on my right hip, so I'm a little bit lifted off of it. Don't break the microphone. That would be very bad. Beautiful team. Good, nice strong legs here. Good. Good, yeah, my left hip doesn't mind internal rotation, but the, everything's on the right side. The side I had knee surgery on doesn't like it, so it's like a range of motion I've had to really work on. Perfect team, go ahead and pop on up. We're gonna take that circuit from the top, so we'll come right back into that squat to squat calf raise or squat to squat jump if your energy is nice and high today. 30 seconds on the clock, team, let's work. Beautiful. Good, explode up. Remember to go at your own pace. I am just your humble guide. Good. I've got some good sweat going. I don't know about you guys, my hair is, I can feel it sticking to my shoulder instead of fluffing up. <laughs> good team. Beautiful. Good, strong legs here. Quads are burning. Good. Perfect team, a few more seconds. Good. Perfect team, shake it off. We're gonna go ahead and come back into that 
Single leg deadlift to a lateral leg raise. Go ahead and shift your weight over towards the left foot. We're gonna send the right foot back. 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Good, hinging at the hips, and then engage that outer hip. Beautiful. Good, team. Good. I used to see like, um, you know, before I lived here, I would see like Hawaiian flower hair clips all the time. And I was like, these just look fake. They look like clay and blah, blah, blah. And then I came here and it was like, are these real? Like <laughs> the flowers actually look just like the hair clips. I was like, so intrigued, beautiful. Not these ones. Um, I'll have to find an example and show you guys a different video. But they like, um, there's five petals and perfect team, shake it off. Same thing, opposite side. 30 seconds on the clock team, let's work. There's five petals and they usually have like a color on the inside that kind of ombres itself out and it's like white on the tips um, and they like overlap the petals. Good team. It's exactly what they look like on the trees and then they fall and I was like, they look just like the clips, it's crazy. Beautiful team, beautiful. Good, nice strong bodies here. Good. A few more seconds. Perfect team, now we're down to, in my opinion, the tough one, the frog pulses. Go ahead and come down flat onto the belly. Make yourself a little pillow with your fist and hands right here. Bring the knees out nice and wide. We got 30 seconds on the clock team, let's work. Big squeeze, good. Blast off, mini blast off, <laughs> good team. I actually have to spend um, the rest of today packing. I don't know about you guys, but I hate packing. <laughs> um, my fiance always makes fun of me because he's just like, what is this? Because um, I don't like to sit there and fold all my clothes and make my everything pretty. I'm more of a shove it in there, make it fit <laughs> type of person. Beautiful team. Perfect. Go ahead and flip on over. We'll come right back into those clammies. Go ahead and come on to the left hip right here. Bend the knees, lift the feet up off the ground. We got 30 seconds on the clock, team. Let's work. Open it up. Good. Good, team. Um, so I'm also like, a, like I'm doing my laundry today on the same day that I have to pack. I'm one of those people. <laughs> Good, team. I don't say I'm a procrastinator in general, but I am if it's something I don't want to do. Um, I'm not with like work, you know? I'm like, oh, get it done and D2D but I don't like packing. As much as I just wanna be in Kauai, I'm like, the process of getting there is really a mission. <laughs> Perfect team, shake it off, same thing. Opposite side, go ahead and flip on over right here. And we come over to the right side, bend those knees right here, lift the feet up. Yeah, three seconds on the clock team, let's work. Um, wait till I go to Bali in November. And away, good. I'm like, the amount of thought and energy that's, that's gonna have to go into that. Good team. Barrier of mine. <laughs> it's burning, I don't know about you guys, but mine's burning. Beautiful team, go ahead and drop, roll on up, get some water if you need it, and we'll come into our cool down. All right team, coming into a cool down, we're gonna go ahead and start with a seated forward fold. So go ahead and come down right here, get nice and comfortable. Start with bending your knees up nice and tight right here, and grab a hold of your toes, and then you're just gonna walk those feet out. All right team, so don't worry about getting like this perfect pancake shape, getting them totally straight. It's okay to keep a nice, generous bend in the knees if you want to. Beautiful, that is a Big time jet going overhead. Good, let everything go heavy right here. Get a nice stretch in the lower back. Good. I think like, um, I think because it's near Labor Day, I, I honestly feel like there's actually more flights coming in than usual. Good team. Good, go ahead and roll it back up right here as we come to a little IT band stretch. I'm gonna go ahead and take my right foot, bend the knee right here and place it over the left knee and then get a hold of this right knee and kind of give a little bit of tug. So you pull a nice stretch in this IT band on the outer side of your thigh and then venture into this spinal twist. Swim the right hand behind, sit up nice and tall. Tile, <laughs> nice and tall. So try not to co collapse in the backhand right here, but sit up nice and tall. Good team. Um, yeah, I think there's actually more planes coming in than usual. Lots of vacationers rolling in here. Good, which makes me really happy to go to Kauai. Kauai is a lot quieter. It's smaller. 
Good team, go ahead and unravel, same thing, opposite side. Go ahead and send the right leg out long, cross the left foot over the right knee right here. Get a hold of this left knee, give a little bit of a tug, and then venture into your twist. Good. Yeah, Kauai is a little quieter, um, a little less touristy. Oahu, because it has Honolulu, um, and that's the hot spot. That's the capital, so that's where a lot of tourists are. Good. Good team. Beautiful, go ahead and come back to center right here. We're gonna come into a butterfly stretch, so uncross the legs, and then go ahead and bring the bottoms of the feet together right here. Send the knees out nice and wide, sit up nice and tall. If you feel like something has grabbed a hold of your belly button and is pulling you backwards, then just walk those feet out a little more, give yourself a little more space. You got none to prove to anybody. Beautiful team, your workout. Your stretch, meet your appropriate edge for today. Good. Um, yeah, I hear Honolulu a lot, and I hear Maui a lot. Those are like the, the hot spots. Um, the Big Island, I'm sure, gets plenty of tourists, but it's bigger, so you can spread them out a little bit more. Um, the other ones are all, we're all pretty small. <laughs> Good team. Good, go ahead and unravel and take your time making your way onto all fours right here, palms and knees. And then from here, you're gonna curl the toes under and lift the hips up nice and high and I'll meet you guys in the down dog. Pedaling out the feet right here, shaking off the fluff. Good, I love down dog. Such an awesome posture, it just feels good. And then when you're ready team, we're gonna go ahead and take the left foot and step it up into a runner's lunge. Find your footing first. And then when you're ready, you're gonna rise up, pivot on the back foot, open it up into warrior two. Good, big transition there. Take your time. Good, ow, <laughs> I moved my hair out of my face and I had a little tangle, it got caught and I pulled on my hair. Good team, good. Deep breaths here, strong warrior pose. Relax the shoulders. Good, then when you're ready, we're gonna go ahead and straighten out through that front leg, bump the hips to the back and reach forward as far as you can. Reach, 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 reach. And then when you reach your breaking point, go ahead and bring those left fingertips down towards the ground, bring the right hand up, triangle pose. Now option here to stare up at the upper fingertips, uh, if your balance will allow it, or you can stare down at the ground for a little more stability. Good. All levels of balance and fitness in general are welcome. Beautiful team. Go ahead and spiral it back down right here. Bend that front knee, plant the palms, and step the left foot back to meet the right. Shake it off right here. I'm gonna do the same little dance on the other side. Go ahead and take that right foot, step it up, find your footing first, and then go ahead and rise it up, pivot on that back foot, open it up into warrior two. Good. Gaze is over the front. Right fingertips, relax the shoulders, pressing into the outer edge of that left foot. Beautiful team. Good, deep breaths here. Good. And then when you're ready, we'll go ahead and straighten out through that front leg, bump the hips to the back, reach forward, forward as far as you can, reach, 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 reach your breaking point, and then bring those fingertips down, open it up, triangle pose. Triangle is another one of my favorites. Good. I like the added challenge of the stability here. Um, and then I like the hamstring stretch it's got going on. Good team, go ahead and Cartwheel it back down right here. Plant the palms, bend that front knee and step it back to meet the left. Last little shake off right here. And then when you're ready, we'll take a nice slow walk. Take your time right here. Crisscrossing the feet in front of each other as you make your way up to your hands. Beautiful. Good, then when you reach your breaking point right here, meet in a forward fold and then slowly, really slowly roll it up vertebrae by vertebrae. Take your time here, feeling out your spine. Good. Beautiful team. And then when you reach the top, we'll go ahead and meet in mountain pose. So feet together, palms face forward right here. And we'll go ahead and say our farewells for today. So on an inhale, go ahead and bring both arms up and overhead, Jai Namaste, big clap, making a round of applause because you deserve it. I always have this vision of if we all do Jai Namaste together, it's like a big round of applause. So big round of applause and go ahead and bring both palms down to the third eye. If you guys enjoyed this workout, please hit the like and subscribe button because I have new workouts every single week and occasional new recipes. And the next workout, I'll give you guys a half marathon recap. It'll be lots of fun. All right, team. Excellent work today. The divine in me honors the divine in you. Namaste. I'll see you guys next time.